Good morning, everyone. I look atrocious, <laughs> literally atrocious. But today I am gonna vlog. So, Steffi, excuse me. <laughs> I'm gonna make a coffee. My favorite coffee that I've been making recently is the apple brown sugar one from Starbucks. I got these from Etsy for people wondering of the chestnut praline and the apple brown sugar. And then I also have the apple drizzle that goes into the drink, but I put it in this bottle because it comes in like a plastic bag. And so I put it in this like reusable chocolate syrup container. So let's make a nice coffee. Oh, perfect amount. Nice. I don't think that's enough coffee, guys. I'm gonna open another one. So good okay so i know i'm using a plastic cup but i do wash and reuse these i've washed i've used this one three days in a row so i do reuse them especially if i'm going out which i am i'm gonna go do a little miniature get ready with me i guess with you guys like do my makeup real quick and then we're going to the korean market to go get some rice cakes because we're gonna do a mukbang on that today if you guys are not already subscribed to the couple channel um go subscribe we do mukbangs every monday and thursday over there and let's go do my makeup oh yeah and here's my little project that i did on my pantry it will be out soon but look how nice that looks oh bougie <laughs> hi vlog so i put on these eyelashes they're called miami light so i like the just like miami from lily lashes but i put on the miami light and i am not feeling them they are like not dramatic enough for me i don't like it so <laughs> i'm gonna take them off and we're gonna try a different one. My ears feel clogged today. I don't know which ones I want. My favorite lashes are downstairs. Which ones are these? Caramel? No. I don't like any of these lashes. <laughs> They're just too like not visible. Like I, like I feel like it looks like I don't even have eyelashes on. I just want like regular Miami. I don't want so extra Miami. I just want regular old Miami or something. What is this one? This is velour. These are like way too dramatic. Ugh, guys, I don't know. Which ones do I wear? I don't like the ones on my eyes right now at all. Maybe I should just wear them. I guess I'll just wear them because they're on. I don't like them. I mean, I love, I think like you, this is for people that like don't like that super dramatic look, but like I'm dramatic and I like a dramatic look. So we're going to try to put mascara on it to make it look more dramatic. Now they just look like freaking spiders. <gasps> uh. What is happening? I don't know. I don't really like them. Whatever. Whatever. Okay. I don't know what I'm gonna do with my hair today. Also, I'm trying to figure out like what to do with my main channel. So like, I'm, I'm constantly trying to find like things that I get excited about. Like me, me and Josh like love our mukbang channel. And then we're also having like a new podcast, which like I'm super excited about. But there's certain things that like, I don't know what to do. Like, I don't know what to do with my main channel. Like, yes, I'm gonna put the new podcast on it, but like, don't you feel like I should be doing something else too? I love like Amazon, but I don't want to have to spend money to do videos. <laughs> I don't know guys. I don't know anymore. These eyelashes are fucking sad. I'm like not even gonna lie. Like, it doesn't even look like I have eyelashes on. We're gonna put on foundation. Oh, actually, let's try. Let's try the new foundation that I have. Where did I put the box? Okay, we're gonna try this one actually. What is it? I don't know how to say it. I don't know how to say this brand's name. But it's the one where you do like the survey online and then it matches you to your skin tone. I don't have spray, I have spray tan on my body left but not on my face. So there should, this should match. If it doesn't match, I'm supposed to return it but I think it's past the return date. So I'm gonna be screwed. <laughs> Cause I bought it and then by the time it came in I already had a spray tan and I had to wait like a week to get my natural skin color back. So this is really hard to open. Okay, seriously, this is ridiculous. It should not be this difficult. 
What the fuck? <laughs> Freak out in a minute. Okay, good. There, there we go. Okay. Let's see. This is supposed to match your skin color. One pump. This is the shade woke up like this. Oh, thanks for the compliment. Okay. <gasps> Are you kidding me? What? So my face is always lighter than my neck. Like, I don't know if you guys could see, but if you put this on my neck, it's literally the same color look. It actually worked from a freaking survey. Ooh, I don't really like the smell of this. It smells like paint, which I actually really don't like the smell of it at all, but it does match my face. It is a little bit darker than my skin tone on my face, but that's kind of how I like my foundation anyways, because my neck and my chest is always darker than my face. My face is just pale because I put sunscreen on it every day. So the sunscreen I use, by the way, is either this Kula Sport Classic Sunscreen. It's white tea moisturizer for your face. Or um, usually I just use my CeraVe daytime moisturizer, which has SPF in it. And then of course, most foundations have SPF too. I wonder if this one does, I don't think it does. So I feel like I need a lot of this. Like I feel like I need to like, I feel like it's not very full coverage and I have to keep, like it's definitely buildable, but I feel like you can totally see like redness through this. Like I could still totally see that, which is weird. And I can see all of the blemishes on my forehead. Okay, honestly, I don't know if I like this. I don't know if it's like actually covering up things or if it's just adding color to my face. Because right now, I feel like I have to go back in with a concealer and conceal all my blemishes, which is fine, but I don't have that bad of skin to be doing that, I feel. Like, I could still see that little tiny, tiny zit that barely has any color. I don't like that I can see that stuff. Also, it dries really fast, which I'm not a fan of. I don't know. To be honest, do I think it's cool that you don't have to go in store and color match yourself? Yes. Do I actually like the foundation? Not really. I think if you had, like, oily skin, Maybe this would be good, but it's really dry. There's no like glow to it, which I don't really love. It's pretty thin and I don't, I feel like you need a lot to cover some, like to cover things up. Honestly, I like the True Match Lumi better from the drugstore. And then obviously my go-to is the YSL foundation. But overall, I don't really love it. So, okay guys, I'm gonna finish my makeup. My favorite concealer, by the way, is the Age Rewind. From Maybelline. Super affordable, lasts forever, super blendable. I'll come back when I'm done. So, me and Josh just filmed a rice cake mukbang. How did you like rice cakes, babe? It was very good. That was his first time trying them. We went to two different Asian markets to find rice cakes. We found them at the second one, but not the first one. They're super affordable. I thought they would be way more expensive, but they were only like $2 for like legitimately 20 of them. So, that's good news. I'm gonna edit a TikTok and I wish I had something better to vlog. I just don't. Wow, you guys can't see the snow on camera, can you? I don't even think they can see. Oh, you can kind of see it, but this has all happened in the past hour. Holy shit. What do we have here? Mom and Sephora. We're having a lazy day. It's a snow day. Yeah, it is. It is a snow day. So, how are you feeling today? Me or Seth? Seth. Okay, no comment. How about you? I feel tired today. Yeah, it's okay to have a lazy day once in a while. Well, I mean, I got work done. Yeah, we, you know, we were productive from the mukbang. You did, I did your OnlyFans stuff. Yeah. I did a TikTok for Fashion Nova. Oh, yeah, Fashion Nova stuff. I mean, I, and it's still snowing currently, and it is almost 4:20. Yeah, it's been snowing for like six, seven hours now. Yeah, it doesn't look like it's slowing down, so that's cool. Yeah, and then today for dinner, we're just having like a free-for-all. Yeah, we're just... I don't really want to make a mess of the kitchen right now. No, and we already filmed the mukbang and made a, a mess, so yeah. already cleaned it. Yeah, but it's okay. We're having a little lazy day after. We can't really do anything. That's true. We're snowed, and there's too much snow, and nothing, still nothing's open yet, so we're good. And Anyways. I have to do a Patreon live tonight. If you guys aren't on my Patreon, go to my Patreon. It's $5. You get two extra videos and a live. And it's really fun for $5. I have to do a live tonight and it's at 9 p.m. So I'm going to have a nap so I could stay up for it. Yeah. Talk to you guys later. Hi, vlog. I'm eating dinner. It is 5.05. Our mukbangs usually fill me like till like nighttime and then I just eat like a snack or something. But today's mukbang was, I mean, it was filling at the time, but it was all legit carbs. Like there was no protein. So I got hungry like an hour after, but I just didn't eat because I wanted to eat till dinner. But I'm having the dill pickle salad kit. 
I can't find this anywhere except Zare's sometimes and then Costco, but on the Costco Instacart app, it's not there. So I have to go in person to get it, which is really annoying. I also got some Jane's chicken strips in here. This is half a bag. I already ate like, let's say a quarter of it. This is half a bag and the Jane's chicken strips are already cooked. They're really fast. If you pop them in the microwave first, cause on the back you can do microwave instructions, but I don't like how soggy they get. So I throw them in the microwave for like a minute every two or like a minute or two minutes if you have like four, you know what I mean? And then I shove them in the broiler. So I put my oven on high broil and then I put the chicken strips in there for like a minute and they end up crispy. So you can cook these in like two minutes. And I just threw some in here. Josh can't eat these, haha, <laughs> loser. What are you gonna have for dinner? I usually cook dinner, but I'm not cooking today. Probably make myself the gluten-free noodle mac and cheese like a fucking loser. <laughs> I really, guys, I really, it is really gonna be difficult to, I mean, it's not gonna be too, too bad, but like, it just sucks that it's super inconvenient. Like, I just can't go have like normal ass shit. It, that's the only shitty part, but. Like, you couldn't even have a bite of this. No, which is fucking bogus, but you know, it is what it is, I guess. You just know. eat a bag of gluten-free chips, though. He doesn't fail to still eat. Oh, no, I'll still find a way. <laughs> I'm not taking that away. Oh, yeah, and he ate like a whole row of oreos or did yeah. you oh yeah did you eat the whole bag or did oh you just... no no not yet not yet give me a minute jesus just started the damn thing bye hi <laughs> okay guys i am on my patreon live i go live every wednesday and i talk to everyone so join patreon if you haven't already it's cheaper than a starbucks drink oh um, is it hey i started that i've said that forever it's cheaper than a starbucks drink yeah who started that me are you lying to the camera right now? No, I started that. Josh, no, you didn't. Ask them. Josh, no, you didn't. When did you start saying it? When I got a Patreon. Hmm. No, you didn't. Hmm. No, you didn't. I believe you. <laughs> okay, everyone. So yesterday after my Zoom call, I just did my nails. I did like two different colored pinks and I put little hearts on it for Valentine's Day and I went to bed. But I do want to tell you guys right now that these are all the Patreon videos I am doing for the month of February. If you guys are interested in any of these videos, it's only $5 to join. And I do give you a refund if you are not happy with your purchase. I also do live streams over there, which I love doing because I could get to connect with you guys like on like a live level where I'm like talking to you in real time, which I love doing. If you guys want to join my Patreon, that would mean so much to me. The Patreon is the reason why I'm able to upload here on YouTube because I do not make enough money on YouTube to still be doing YouTube. So shout out to Patreon members and also shout out to you guys for still being here and watching my videos. I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!